It's Friday, and you know what that means. Here it is, the final episode of Let's Play Assassin's Creed Valhalla. The reason why I know it's the final episode, this is the Battle of Chippingham with Guthrum. What ended up happening in that battle, they won the battle but lost the war. Um, what ended up happening is Guthrum, to remain in England, decided to get baptized into Christianity. And... It basically ended the whole Viking rule of uh, of England, basically. This, so this is how I know this is the final battle. Um, Guthrum wants to stay in England. That was the that's the legend, right? So I, that's why I feel that's why it's called Holy Day. I think this is the final battle, the Chippenham. So with that out of the way, guys, let us get to it without any further ado. Before we do, though, just want to mention, trying to grow this channel one more time, guys. That strive for 250. Um, the year is closing in upon us. Halloween is in a couple days. So, uh, you know, I got something special planned for that day. So, look, be on the lookout for that. Um, with that out of the way, make sure you follow the Discord server. Make sure you like, comment, subscribe, all that good stuff. Share with your friends if you like this. Hope you guys been enjoying like our wrestling commentaries, our wrestling uh, reviews. We had Extreme Rules. We've had Bound for Glory. We got Survivor Series coming up in a month. We've had, uh, we got, uh, yeah, we've had, uh, and we're going to have this coming Tuesday is going to be our Halloween Havoc review. So hopefully you guys have been enjoying this and hopefully you guys will stay tuned for more. Um, yeah, other than that, without further ado, we are going to get right into gameplay and finish the game. First things first, though, I'm going to want a stronger weapon. As good as this is... Uh, not 30, 161. That looks powerful. 159 Excalibur, clearly. 109 Basim Sword. Can I upgrade it, though? Let's see what happens when I... Excalibur is fully upgraded. Oh no, I can upgrade that too. Oof. Let us well let's upgrade Basim's sword and see. 115. 127. 134. That's the max I can do it. Okay. Which is still not bad, but Yeah, these are much, much weaker. We are gonna go with Excalibur. And we cannot upgrade it. I wasted my upgrades on it. This is fully upgraded. We are going to go with Excalibur. Because, you know, it's Excalibur. Okay. Do I have any better helmets? I don't have too many helmets, do I? 45, 44. Well. Just to increase my power level a little bit. Okay, we are at its max. Alright, and let us equip some runes into it. Stealth damage. No, I don't need poison buildup. Range resistance. Let's equip that. Yeah. I think we're good. Which one do I have equipped? Kenway's robes, right? 36, 32, 36. They're all at... Oh, 25. No, 21. 64. Let's go with that one, because that's the most powerful one. Alright. And bow. That's it. Put the most powerful bow. 82, that's the one. Oh, 94. Yeah. 102. Let's go with that one. That won't be the best one. Okay. All right, guys. Let's get to it. Eivor, you made it unscathed. They came from all over England.
I'm trying to find the screenshot for the final. There they are, all my friends, Broder, Vili, Hunwald, some weird kid, I forgot who it is, that's the son of the guy. I never thought it possible, Eivor, that you would rally Saxons and Norse under your black feathered banner. They see the tyranny of this elf king. He would crush them all under heel and plug their hearts with his god. So what is the plan, Eivor? When is their feast day? A few nights from now, but their revelry has already begun. We should attack now. That is unwise. Soldiers pace the paths of the village. Then the night of the feast, under cover of darkness. That is when we will strike. Uba will not have died in vain. So we await dead. your instructions, Eivor. Let us plan our approach. But whatever happens, Alfred is mine. They are not expecting us. We should not meet much resistance on the way. But they are. Then quietly through the fields. It will already be too late once they see us. Your young Saxons can be our eyes to the west. Better to keep their soft hands away from the conflict. My scouts reported that a few nobles have arrived for the festivities already. Good. If we capture the Thanes, there will be no danger when I confront Alfred. And we could persuade them to support a new king of Wessex. I will subdue the lords. Take Deolaf and Tefta with you. They could prove useful in convincing the Thanes. Rhoda, take Erkian Stowe and capture the garrison. Make quick work of any Saxons that dare cross into the village. <laughs> Gladly, Eivor. Okay. We need to know our parts. May they blunt their swords against our might. Okie dokie. We're ready to go. We're ready to go, guys. The Battle of Cheppenham is upon us. Tonight, Wessex's last resistance will crumble. I follow ah! you, Eivor. And I. Be we ravening know. wolves and croaking ravens. Stand firm, your axe arms strong, and together we will win this final battle. <laughs> and remember, Alfred is mine. Soma, with me. Everyone else, go quickly to the village. Advance, be on the lookout for any stray guards. Is there a actual? Wait for my signal. I shouldn't be seen here. The hood should work. <laughs> Let's smoke the rat out of his gun. Let's smoke the rat out of his guard's house. See you, old friend. Guessing it'll be here. I have a bad feeling about this. Did you think my king would turn his back yeah, on you, Abel? Of course. When your knife is smeared with the blood of Wera. Stand aside, Goodwin. I come for Alfred. Alfred is long gone. And this good Christian feast, a cup of honey wine, to trap some wasps. Where is he? Calling his allies to his side. All those who wish to see Wessex under one god. Of course. 
cannot win England with your sorry crew of deluded farmers and godless fools. I knew At least that. I wouldn't leave them to die as I scurried through the corn husks like a rat. You have no understanding of duty, the loyalty I freely give. His plan for England, for the world, is worth the cost of my life. Then sing your tuneless hymns. Come, Raven Feeder. Do your worst. Okay, let's. Saints alive! Such efforts are fury. It does not matter if I die as long as Alfred is safe. Your life means so little. <laughs> Again. How did I get stuck here? How am I? Get out of there! Got him. I was expecting a lot harder. A lot harder. I got stuck in a corner. This was much, much easier than the Bassam fight. I was expecting chaos. You are beaten, Goodwin. Beaten? No. Not so. By my death, my lord may live. Alfred used you, fool. He threw you in my path. For what? He only delays what is inevitable. Kill me then. It makes no odds. For here you stand, bloody and breathless, no closer to my king, no closer to his throne. This island will never be your home, Eivor. You will not subdue her with vicious force See, or I knew that was coming. cocksure words. We Saxons will always stand firm. Shoulder by shoulder against thieves and tyrants whose envious eyes fall upon England. I will kill if you. If I must strike down all of England to subdue her, let it begin with you. O oh Lord, into your hands I commit my spirit. <laughs> You're supposed to be my friend! Alright. Now, what's next? Look at Soma kicking ass! They came from every house and hovel! So she kept in America. Soma, fall back! For life! Oh, shit. Well, that's 
the end of Soma. For glory! Soma! For no! Damn. Look at the random sword and shield flying back there. You're one too, brother. We bring Christ's mercy! Guthrum, I need you fighting with the rest. These men will not surrender. And one little cock flog barricaded himself behind that door there. I will find a way in. Us on our holy feast today. I'll finish you. Ah, you will regret this unholy invention. Ah, you I know you. <laughs> <laughs> What the? Mm. over here did you see Alfred no the Saxon boys were ambushed one lays wounded hold these men back I'll find them go away Von. they will not better us one won't come get up this is no time for weep wailing I I cannot and there is a blackness closing in around my eyes it frightens me Forgive me, Homeworld. I should have been quicker. No. No. But you were my staunch protector, Ellerich. Have you seen I will carry him from the fray. To that farmhouse there. I will get you to safety, Homeworld. Stay calm. No, that's the garrison. Your time's up, Kurt. Die, you. Where am I going? As I was saying... I will get you to safety, Hunwald. Stay calm. I... I may be all right. There it is, okay. I was going the wrong direction. 
Because the other one said carry Honwald. Uh. <coughs> Honwald, listen to me. You survived the Battle of Bottleston. Do not let this scratch best you now. I'm so cold. Has winter come so soon? Yes, it has. You will warm yourself with mead and dancing yet, my friend. Perhaps not, Ava. It may be I will sit beside my father soon. Will he be proud of me? He will pull you to his breast. Sob bright words of welcome and... Until you know man ever had a worthier son. I am glad to have known you, Eivor. My truest... Friend? Well, there's another one gone. Let's take the hood off. There was nothing more. I need to see if Broda has taken the garrison. Now I can make my way that way. to open the gates from the inside. Hurry! These waves of reinforcements are hell sent. the garrison stays under our control. I need to help the others. Dude, that was pretty easy for the garrison. Mr. Garrison? I know what day it is. Interlopers, 
Not on this Christ mass! Oh, look at that. I found something. Stand true! God protects us on his day of feasts! How many more are there? Okay, loading screen. They are routed! The city is ours! Wessex will follow! Uh, I don't think so, Tim. Good from y'all. We are not without losses. Some of them grave. Their king is fled! His patsy struck down! Defeat rings loud in their ears, and I will be their lord before the spring is here! Good from mm. hear me! Soma is... She's gone. Why'd you put your hood back on? Soma? Dead? She has gone to the Endless Feast, and she is the better for it. I must speak to those still living. It is done, Brodia. You fought well. I saw him, Havor. In my darkest moment, Brothir stood beside me. And all was as it used to be. And then the battle ended. I feel him no longer. There will be other battles. Aye. And there you'll find me, Havor. In amongst the blood and death. Brothir at my shoulder. Until the Valkyries claim me. You have given me more than I would ever have asked for. How will I repay it? Keep him in your thoughts. For when a man is mourned, his deeds cheered and his songs sung, he cannot die. Okay. Take off the goddamn hood! <laughs> Lufina. Gods, I... I did not know. Is, is he...? Hush. What good can words do, Havor? Keep to silence. He is gone. For what days I was given to spend with you. For each breath that carried your sweet whispers. I give thanks. No more. Your fingers in my hair. No more your arms around my waist. The days will be cold hereafter. All color dimmed. Good 
I am my only. My heart ends with you. What is left will go on. Okay. Your first battle, Illerich. You fought well and with honor. Is this the glory you deign seek? You can keep it. I saw Hoonwald die. The light dim in his eyes. That could have been me. You will never be the same. But you will be stronger for it. I have wasted so much time in pouting like a child. No more, Eivor. No more. Do you think there will come a day when winning will not be enough? Well, you can always fight with me if you want to taste crushing and loin-soiling defeat. My very presence would make that impossible. Enjoy yeah. this victory, Eivor, wherever it brings you. Only a coward thinks he'll live forever. My thanks, though. You came to my aid when you were free to turn away. And still it breaks my heart to look upon what we've done today. Was it the right choice? I do not know. But it is done now. If Alfred had his way, there would never be friendship between Norse and Saxon. You fought for peace. Be proud of that. I wish I could. And in time, perhaps I will. Okay. Erke, you wear a furrowed brow. Stowe is taking matters hard. You know how sensitive he is. Mm -hmm. A man of faith and stout morals. Small wonder he is tormented. His support for you has taxed him hard. I will take him back to London. Maybe he will find some comfort there. You are his comfort, Erke. Not the city you watch. He is in good hands. Tedware. You are not injured, Tefta. Bruises, that is all. I've taken the Lord into my heart, and he watched over my sorry bones. Those who fell sit beside him now. And what of my heathen friends? I used to believe in damnation for all who turned from his light. But there is a wondrous communion in friendship honored. Even though your godson preaches peace. And we shall do that? Christians and pagans, side by side, never persecuted. Your Christ would smile at that, I think. Your Freya would too. That's he last shall come to judge the living and the dead. Deolaf, Gidrich, there's a solemn air about you. To disturb such holy revels with blood and murder. I fear God may never forgive me for this. Had your guard taken Alfred's side, we would not have won. So it may be you did his work after all. Alfred still lives. And now I am twice his enemy. Give me one more fight, and I will gladly make it a third. He is defanged and of little threat to us now. That slippery eel may yet surprise you. Atonement is a long and lonely path. And I must soon leave to take my first steps upon it. Okay. Your debts to me are paid. I wish you well on your journeys. <laughs> I think that's it. Talk to everybody. My heart is heavy. Many fought for us and died. They deserve peace. I agree. Are you ready to honor them? Yes. I am. Yes. There's nothing more to say. Time to send our friends to their great reward. Will you do the honors? Absolutely. Nothing awaits them. They lived, they died. 
And now their bodies will burn to cinders. Their saga ends here. Well, do not share that with them. Victory is ours. But it came at a great cost. Soma Yalskona, who stood at Guthrum's right hand. She will live on in our memories from now to the end of days. Helen was the saddest. And to your warrior, husband, and a friend, he made the ultimate sacrifice. I here repay it. And to Hunwald, whose kind heart has now led him to his father's side. May his God welcome him with open arms. Let us send them on their way. All our beloved dead, our fallen warriors, and speed them to their end. That's that. I think that's it, guys. I think that is the end of the game. This one will not be over the hour mark. A little tired. But hey, you know, we did it. Chappenham. See, the Battle of Chappenham. That thing is still there. King of Wales, Broder, see, Guthrum is praying. He was converted. Guthrum. When the Reeve died, did he take comfort in knowing he would soon see his god? He was strangely peaceful in the end, as if death meant nothing. We stumble through our years, ravenous, grasping, spilling blood, stealing gold, and it is never enough. Say. This life is never enough. Would it not suit you to know there is something beyond all this? Not war and valor, but quiet and peace. I think... I think the afterlife men hope for is only a reflection of their regret in this life. All That's I wish for now is to live among the friends I've made. That is what counts. Alfred made me swear fealty upon See? the cross of their god's son. He held such faith in it. A plain, unadorned thing. It burned between my fingers, as if I had pulled it from the fire. A feeling strange and powerful, but gone in an instant. I have not felt its light before. What will you do now? Whatever I must do. England is my final home, Eivor. And I will See? do what it That's takes That's what I told you at the beginning to of, the, of the video. I should return to Swanborough and tell her of Hunwald's fate. Better the news comes from me than a stranger. True. But I think there's a couple of things I want to collect here before...
See, there's a few things in here I want to collect before I head out. Gotta be a way in here. See so you right there. No. Stupid. Should be one more here. And then I will make my way home. Go, bunch of supplies. <laughs> now we can make our way back. Skills. We'll do that at the end. We don't need it right now. A couple runes. More of these poison runes, which I don't need. I got too many of them. Quest has ended. So guys, I just want to thank you on coming on this journey with me. This has been fun. I've always loved the Assassin's Creed games. And uh, who knows, maybe in March, by the time I finish Spider-Man, there may be another Assassin's Creed game to play. So uh, hopefully that'll uh, keep us satisfied until then. Like I said, November 4th, Spider-Man Part 1 playthrough. We'll get into that. That game is a lot of fun. I've played it already and I'm playing it again. I'm looking forward to playing it again. Let us go to Swanboro. Poor girl. Hello there, friend. Hello. Thor's testicles. What is happening over there? Thor's testicles? Eivor? Swanbro, I... No. Gods, no. Don't say it, please, Eivor. Yes. Don't say it. I am sorry. Oh! My hope. No! My poor swan! Oh, gods! He fought bravely and turned the tide to secure a victory. Your dear Hunwald died a hero, and will be so remembered. Oh, gods. I know he would have fainted to hear such praise from your lips. Thank you, Eivor. Thank you. He walks among warriors now. Yes, the lucky man. 
I imagine he does. I know words are poor solve for a wounded heart. I will leave you to mourn and know that we are here for you, always, should you need us. No good can come of this. What has gotten into them? I don't know, but... Eivor, there you are. I have something for you. A message. Oh. Quite strange. Mouse, how are you, my boy? I will do that after. That is probably... Mm, I know what that is. The Last Order. So we'll do I that know. today, too. Hamptonshire has fallen. And with it, the Kingdom of Wessex. But the cost was great. Maybe too great for all we gained. Rest, then. You have earned it. On the backs of so many. Time will tell if it was worth it. England, you have pacified, but you have not... Okay. So that is... the end. Here. I am now sitting the throne. That is me. <laughs> but uh, yeah, I am now... Uh, that was pretty much it. I've... Uh, I've, I think this is the last thing to do, so I think what better way to end it than with the last order of the ancient? Which I'm guessing this is what this is. Something for me. What is it? A letter requesting your presence in the southwest, a village called Athelny. Nothing strange about a summons for me, is there? It is not the recipient I find strange, it is the sender. The letter is signed, a poor fellow soldier of Christ. Ah, uh, our mysterious partner. For a short time, I hoped it might be Bassam feeding us the names of these targets. No. Nope. He seemed the most likely man, for a time. Only one way to discover the truth. Thank you, Hytham. I will take care of this. You look well today, Eivor. How far? Ooh, it's far. I will take my boat there. Because low lie the fields of Athenry, where once we saw the small free bird fly. Dropkick Murphys. Which is an old Irish song anyway. But go check out that song. It's a good song. Yeah, so like I was saying, what better way to begin November than with the new game, Spider-Man. We're going to hunt the last member of the order here. Oh my god, I'm so looking forward to finding out who this is. Um, it's clearly not Bassam. Clearly, because we saw what happened to him. He is actually controlling Ivor right now in the Animus. So, it can't be Bassam. Clearly. My guessing... What if it's Alfred? Okay. You're off. All right, I gotta turn around, right? Yeah. Let the sail out. See you. Who will share a tale? 
In the early days of the feud between Kiotve the Cruel and the Raven Clan, there was a mad berserker called Kiar Robo. Kiar had pledged his battle fury to no king or yar, and would give his oath only once each winter for reasons nobody could fathom. One year, Kiar's sister, Fura, was married to Kiotve's brother, Alrek, and soon Kiar was often seen in the company of that clan. Hold on, good scum. This I got. yourself. This I gotta make my way on my own now. <laughs> I'm not that far now, anyway. Three hundred meters is nothing. Because there's a town right there. We are here. Who is the letter sender? Someone we probably wouldn't expect or even met yet, I bet. All right there? Yes, hello. I, I do not mean to intrude, but I am looking for someone. And who would that be then? I... I do not know exactly. Well, that would be why you ain't found him. But you're free to pass the time just here if you like. Okay. Thank you. Soul cakes, love. Do you know soul cakes? I do, I enjoy them. They're small things, size of a lumpy fist, so they'll bake fast. Keep your eyes sharp. And the butter, do I baste them? No need, love. We leave the butter for meal time. I look forward to it. Right then. I'll leave you to this. King if you Alfred. need me, I'll be doing the washing up next door. Quite a step down from your former work, Lord. As their guest, I volunteer to help with the daily chores. They offer me a bed. I tend the cakes. Do they not feel strange giving orders to their king? Or do they know? That knowledge would benefit no one. I read your message. You went through a great deal of trouble to obscure yourself as this poor soldier of Christ. As I remember, you even sent yourself one of these letters in Winchester. Oh, damn. A touch. The Order wanted me dead. I had to be careful. You said you knew nothing about the Order then. Pled ignorance. But you knew everything. Their names. Their schemes. Would you join me for a walk? You look well, Eivor. Oh no, don't freeze now. I am. The wars have ended, and my settlement thrives. The wars have not ended. You have simply stopped fighting. But it's not him. So it's not him. plots in mead halls and bedrooms. You will see. And how are you, Alfred? Getting used to the idea of being unremarkable? I am well. Better than I expected. In this exile, I have found a somewhat uh, nourishing peace. Each morning, I am awakened by the. Oh, here. Let's let us do this. Alfred and Ivor side by side. There we go. That'll be our, uh, that'll be our final image for the 
sun and growling cormorants. I bathe in the chilly water of the marsh. I eat from shrubs and drink from buckets. It is a good life. Simple. Blessed. Okay. I've never been so far west. I find it quite peaceful here. Calming. I have traveled a long way to hear one name, Alfred. Who is the Otis Grand Magister? It's me. Tell your shadowy friends that England is swept clean. Your work is done. You? Grand Magister was not a title I desired. It passed to me on the death of my brother. From my father before him. Defilers of God's majesty and grandeur. I was their master, and I loathed them. Hmm. With Goodwin, I set a plan in motion to destroy the order from within. But my troubles with the Danes delayed that plan. But your trouble with this Dane is what led to their demise. You are Norse, are you not? You have a good year. I owe you my thanks, Eivor. For that, I give you this. The key to my study. That you may better understand the good you have done. Oh. With the order all but destroyed, you have made room for a greater idea. One to take its place. Okay. A universal divine order. Inspired by God for the betterment of man. With a poor fellow soldier at its head. You have saved England. Whether or not that was your intent. Now let England save you. Okay. England is no more, Lord. You are the last of her kings. And yet you have no kingdom. Look around you. God's works are wondrous. They cannot be ignored. Nor resisted. In time, all those who accept God will flourish. And all those who defy him will fall away. Should you remain in England, you too will one day be her subject. Oh, bloody crumbs! The cakes are burnt! Where is that man? Young man, where have you gone? Damn. That may have earned me a night of washing linens. I do not know if we shall meet again, Eivor. God willing, we will. As one lord to another, perhaps. I'm coming, my lady. I'm here. Okay. Now what? Alfred gave me a key to unlock his study. Somewhere in Winchester. Oh dear, oh dear. Look at them little balls of soot. Good lady, forgive me. I was lost in thought. No matter. Just let him cool him. That is. We did it, guys. Oof. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. We can do that. And Alfred's key. So, we may have yet some stuff to do after all. So, my guess would be where I met Alfred the first time. In Winchester. So let us go. Why is it unavailable? Direct me and I will obey. Where are you going? Pip? Can I not fast travel? Why is fast travel unavailable? Leave the town, maybe? Can 
I fast travel now? Weird, okay. Well, we'll make we'll start making our way there. If we can fast travel, we'll fast travel. If not, we're SOL. But we'll make our way there regardless. Because I want to see what's inside this chest. Or this in this study, whatever it is. I'm nearing the Avon River at Uthentune. This was where Alfred set the battle with Upper took place. Upper. So Alfred spoke true. What? May you join your brother, old friend. Wherever he found his final peace. Rest well, my friend. Oh shit. Uba. That's him. Damn. Okay then. Weird, okay. Yeah. Along the river there. Still unavailable, why? Yeah. Weird. Has it been disabled? I have to wait to cross yeah. the other side of the river. Uh, Kenny Satch. Let's try now. Why is fast travel unavailable? That is so weird. Yeah, no time. So what I'll do there, to spare you the guys the time. Fast travel's unlocked, so we're finally gonna do it. Didn't want us, I wanted to spare you guys a long, tedious horse ride of nothing, so. So his study was where we first met him in the, in the Winchester uh, story arc. So I'm guessing that's where it's gonna be, that the minister, the old, the, that church, that chapel, whatever it was. Remember we went up the stairs with that bishop guy who was, hallelujah, guy, yeah. So I think that's where it's going to be. Um, yeah, we'll finish this off, guys. We're going to we're gonna finish this off. We're going to find out what's in Alfred's study, fast travel back to Raventhorpe, check in with Hytham, complete the order, and end the game, guys. We're almost, almost there. Last little few things, last... The last of the loose ends to tie up, basically, is what we're doing. So, yeah, like I said, look forward. November 4th, first Friday in November, we will have the first episode of Spider-Man. And this m Monday on Halloween, I'm going to have a special video out for you guys as well. Oh, I am there. So this is it. I just got to find a way. There it is, right there.
Ah, there it is, there it is, right there. This is it, Alfred's study. What secrets has he kept hidden away? Ooh, there's a bunch of stuff in here. Okay. <laughs> Charlemagne. Is that it? That's it. I was expecting like some sort of weapon or... That was a little lackluster. Yeah, that was a little lackluster. I was expecting some sort of really cool weapon or shield or some armor or something. But nah, just some supplies. That was kind of lackluster. Oh, here's the key. You've defeated all the ancients. No, I think the real prize is going to come when I hand Hytham all the last 15 medallions from the Order of the Ancients. I think that's, what, that's where the real prize is coming. And that's where we'll end it after we receive that prize, guys. We're almost there. Almost there. Almost there. Come on. Come on. It's taking a long time to load today. There we go. There we go. Make our way to Hytham. Come on now. Avor. A moment of your time. Yes, we will. Yes, one more, and only because you all have such good taste. Now, this one. This one begins a long time ago at a desert oasis. Far away. All right. Eivor, did Basim contact you in Norway? He said he would be joining you. Yet here you are, and I have no word from him. Aha. Uh -huh. This will be hard to hear, but... Basim attacked us in Norway. Vengeance for some transgression of ours, imagined or real. You mean... You mean you slew him yourself? No. Sigurd and I, together. I know this comes as a... I do not understand. Why would he do such a thing? He loved Sigurd, he loved you. No, he didn't. I do not understand it myself. Perhaps one day we can speak about this with more clarity. But for now, I am deeply sorry. I cleared Winchester of the Order, yet to do so meant working with King Alfred. Your poor fellow soldier led you to the King of Wessex? How very strange. He, or she, is toying with you, it seems. Here you are, Hytham. The last of the Order's sigils. You will find King Alfred's among them. King Alfred? Did our poor fellow soldier lead you to his hiding place? He did. But they were one and the same. Uh. Our poor fellow soldier of Christ was the Grand Magister of the Order of the Ancients. He turned on his own order. Fascinating. Not turned so much as trampled. His devotion to Christ and what he calls a universal order set him against them from the start. With all sincerity, he loathed the title and the duty he had inherited and wished them destroyed. Wonderful. With his abdication, the last stronghold of the order has been dismantled. All that remain are scraps here and there. And you, Eivor. Now that you have seen our enemy and you understand our cause, I wonder if you would join us. 
become a hidden one. Was this your ultimate goal, Hytham? A trial hmm. by fire? It is a kind offer, but I do not believe we fight for quite the same cause. Your creed demands that you keep your triumphs hidden. Yeah. I prefer my glory to be in plain view for all to see. If I taught you our creed, if you spent time with it, it could open your mind to another view. Another view is always welcome. But to live without celebrating one's glory and honor and achievements is not a life for me. Okay. But know this. I would give my life in a moment for those I love and who love me in return. All here. Including you, my friend. I understand you well, Eivor. Very well, Very well indeed. indeed. So we got something cool. Thor's cape. Oi. And of course it froze. But we got Thor's cape. So with that out of the way, guys. Thanks again for joining us. This has been an outstanding adventure. We have finally finished Assassin's Creed Valhalla. We did it 100%. There's still some side quests. I'm going to do those on my own when I have some time. As far as videos go, this was the last Assassin's Creed Valhalla video. So thanks again. It was part 71. We'll just call it finale because I like part 70 and finale. So we're going to leave it at that. But for... for that's it guys i i don't know what to say like this has been a long arduous journey it has been fun it's been a year and a half here is thor's cloak like look at this thing it's beautiful but uh yeah it's been a it's been a fun adventure it's been a fun journey stay tuned next week well actually stay tuned on sunday it's a brand new episode of lego marvel superheroes we're getting close we're getting close um Monday will be a very special Halloween episode that I'll post for you guys. I'm not going to say anything, but it will be a special episode of Hall on Halloween. Tuesday will be our uh, another episode of the Coffee and Cannoli podcast. And then Friday after that will be Spider-Man Part 1. So thanks again for joining us. Thanks again for all your f support, all your uh, everything. Let's see what Thor's hood looks like. Nice. That looks majestic. Yeah. So, with that out of the way, guys, thanks again for joining us, and keep on gaming.